Hi everybody, it's Saturday. We're at the Imagination Station. I have Carl with me. No doubt, most of us probably listen to music day in and day out. So sure. there's a lot behind that sound, right? There's, there's a lot of physics, there's lots of art behind making music. And we've got a guest artist coming into Imagination Station the month of December. Okay. It's gonna be here every Saturday except for the 23rd. And he's showing us how to make musical instruments using just ordinary stuff. I'm really excited about this. And anybody can be a musician. I think one of my favorites though is just the simplicity of a slinky, on a cup. Okay. All right. I'll show you. This it is so cool because, you know, with the Star Wars movie coming mm -hmm. out, just flick it. You got a blaster noise maker, <laughs> right? There you go. Every parent's dream. Yes. Blasters. It's so cool because, you know, the vibrations in the slinky are being sort of amplified by the rigid cup. It acts sure. like a little bit of a speaker. Okay. So simple stuff. I mean, and you can have fun with sound. All right. So that's, that's one thing. Um, another is uh, this thing right here. We got, I, I don't even know what you call it, but it's a string and a can on a board. And what's kind of cool is if you put this on here and then take this, um, just go ahead and bang on the string. Okay, by changing where I put this, we kind yeah. of change the length of the string, okay. but it's kind of hard to hear. It is kind of hard to hear. So, you, can, you can hear it very softly. That's where this comes into play. All right. This little thing right here is a crystal um, embedded in a little piece of plastic. It's called a piezoelectric crystal. When you stress it, mm -hmm. it generates a voltage. Okay. If you take that voltage and put it into a guitar amp, like this one, you can actually hear the sound. So. Oh. Okay, cool. Okay. So let's try it again. But now, we're gonna put this right underneath the string okay. to help us amplify that sound. So right. you go ahead and do the tapping. Let's crank up the volume a bit. Cool. So this this little device here, this little piezoelectric thing, is our new favorite friend because you can add it to almost anything, and you've turned an acoustic instrument into sort of an electric yeah. instrument. Yeah. Awesome. In fact, this guy right here, a little uh, kalimba or thumb piano. Okay. Right. You, you can play. Go ahead and play it. Just on a cigar box, right? On a cigar box. But it gets even better if we plug it in because inside, what have we done? Oh. Check this out. Inside, if I can figure out how to open it we've added one of those crystals. Oh, cool. So All it's right. picking up the vibration. So go ahead and play again. And when you add it, it almost feels like it picks up like different tonalities. Yeah. Sounds that's that impressive. You, that you might not hear. Yeah, that's so, really cool. I mean, all sorts of cool stuff. We got, you know, one of your favorites, I think. The rain is stick. The, it's a cardboard tube. It's filled with beads and nails that have been driven inside of it. So. I mean, how cool is that? These are also some solid DIY Christmas presents Absolutely. for the toddler crowd. Absolutely. <laughs> or, or for the dads, you've got a collection of baseball bats at home. Oh, wow. Right? This is super cool. You Just the look of this is amazing. So here, take, take some mallets. You invest in some of these little piezo things. Okay. They're on the back. Go ahead and start uh, playing. Just give it a run on. All right, so you got a baseball bat xylophone. That's really cool. So really cool stuff. We actually will be selling these little things in our um, vending machine for oh, okay. a couple bucks. So if you come awesome. in, you build an instrument with David Nelson, and you can learn how to make it sort of electric. That is so cool. We've got, if you know, the, these were cool. I love the slinky things because yes. they're so simple. We, he actually brought in a slinky garden oh. over here. All right. So check this out. We've got. And this all... looks like something that you could, if you had a little bit of talent, make. Absolutely. Pretty neat. Um, yeah. Let me crank it up here. I'll get right. out of the way. All right. And so, yeah, it's PVC pipes, slinkies, and those little piezos. Give them. Oh wow, this sounds like a mo like movie yeah. sounds. You're like a foley artist, you yeah. know? Yeah. So, come on down, check out David. He's he's really creative. We've got all sorts of instruments, even things that were like broken, like this old violin. Uh -huh. It didn't have a, a what do you call that? A, a bridge on it I don't or whatever. Know what you mean. Yeah. Um, little bottle goes in place, and now we've sort of resurrected it. That is so neat. Lots of cool stuff. Making things with stuff you have at home. That is it's a so lot of fun. awesome. Well, I'll tell you what, Carl, this is a very cool one, something that you can do, and David Nelson will be here for two more weekends. You have a chance to catch him right down here at the Imagination Station on Saturdays. And that's how you imagine it.